Well, it's a very important visit. This from the point of view of Brazilians. We've seen this in Brazilian media quite a lot. This is actually the third time that President Luiz Inácio Lula da Silva is on official visit to China, but the two previous ones in his previous terms in power in 2004 and 2009. This time, actually, the trip was postponed for a few weeks due to a president's health condition, but it did happen less than one month after initially planned. And there is an extensive agenda for uh, Lula da Silva that includes uh, several bilateral agreements that are going to be signed between the two governments. In the most diverse fields, of course, trade and investment are the ones that have been attracting more attention, but there are also agreements in the area of culture, media, tourism, several areas that are going to be discussed by a large delegation that's accompanying uh, President Luiz Inácio Lula da Silva about 300 people being around 50 politicians, ministers, governors, other government officials, and about 250 uh, business people that are very much interested in this trip to do business in China. And we can say actually that there was a lot of interest in uh, people to join the delegation of Luiz Inácio Lula da Silva as this uh, promises to be a very interesting trip also to the other side of the world and also with uh, big opportunities for uh, business and uh, businesses and agreements.